It's Wednesday the 20th of June 2018 and I'm at East Grinstead station to do a walk along Greenwich Meridian Trail and I've got a companion with me. Now need to walk through the town to the start of the walk. Now at St Swithin's Church East Grinstead where we join the route of a Greenwich Meridian Trail. Inside St Swithin's Church, East Grinstead. Passing the graves of the three Protestant martyrs in the graveyard of St Swithin's Church and the walk proceeds up there. We head through this lich gate and carry on along the road ahead. Now passing Chequermead Water Tower built in 1914. many historic buildings and places in East Grinstead. Now at what is known as the War Memorial Gardens and there's a lovely Acer. We now pass this Greenwich Meridian stone Now passing the splendid Millennium Stone. Now crossing the London to East Grinstead railway line. And we continue along that track there. And there is a Greenwich Meridian Trail Waymark which you should be familiar with from the other videos of Greenwich Meridian Trail on my channel. And the path continues down there. Now heading through Alders Wood on the Greenwich Meridian Trail. Very peaceful here. Now heading along this path through Alders Wood The walk now heads across this footbridge over a small stream. Now over another footbridge. Still on Greenwich Meridian Trail. Way marking not too good in this area. Greenwich Meridian Trail's now left the wood and we're going through this field with bushes. Greenwich Meridian Trail now heads along this enclosed footpath. Now beside Cook's Pond with the spectacular viaduct carrying the London Victoria to East Grinstead Railway. I'm having to poke through a fence here but the view is spectacular. And here's another view of it from a slightly different direction. And here's a nice oblique shot of the viaduct and Cook's Pond. Some lovely water lilies in the foreground. And here comes a train over the viaduct.
by the path where the pond is, on the other side of the path, there are these beautiful flowers. If anyone knows what they are, can they leave a comment? Further Greenwich Meridian trail sign. A bit further on from the last clip, and we're also on the Tandridge border path here. We're now on a footpath beside the London Victoria to East Grinstead Railway, heading for Dorman Station. A fantastic path beside the railway line. Now at Dorman Station and we turn right over the railway along here. After crossing the railway, Greenwich Meridian Trail turns left along this footpath. This is a commemoration stone of the Meridian laid in the year 2000. Now heading across a golf course on this path. Now crossing some fairways. There's the path ahead going into some more woodland. We now turn right along this wide track, heading for a main road. Now at the B2028, where we turn left towards Lingfield Racecourse. We now turn right off the main road along this path towards Lingfield Railway Station. Now at Lingfield Station, which obviously would be an opting out point of the walk, but the walk continues up there. Now at the Star Inn Lingfield, and as you can see, we're on Greenwich Meridian Trail. Now at Lingfield Church. Now inside Lingfield Church. And here we have the First Lord Cobham in Lingfield Church. Greenwich Meridian Trail now heads along the edge of this playing field with good views in the distance. Further on, we come to this kissing gate before another road. Across the London Victoria to East Grinstead railway line. After the railway, Greenwich Meridian Trail proceeds along the left hand edge of fields. Styles coming up. We now cross this style and head up the path to the road ahead. Watch this expert style crossing. Here's the start of the next footpath along that edge of that field. Looking back, there's the Lingfield and Crowhurst Age to Age walk, whatever that is. Greenwich Meridian Trail now heads across this field along a clear path. One of the sort of signs I don't like. Yes. And more adept style manipulation there. And now we 
go across that field. Now we're heading across this field with decent views ahead and slightly to the left. Greenwich Meridian Trail now continues along the edge of that field, but ahead, superb views. The walk recrosses the railway line, and here we turn right along that road ahead for a short distance. The Greenwich Meridian Trail passes a Crowhurst Parish Church. Now inside Crowhurst Parish Church, considerably smaller than the other two churches. And there's the font. Greenwich Meridian Trail leaves the Crowhurst along this track. Next we head along the edge of this field. Greenwich Meridian Trail now crosses the Red Hill to Tombridge railway line. And that's the actual crossing. We now have a brief interlude through a wood. Now along the edge of this field, which is quite difficult walking, coming to the end of it now hopefully though. Greenwich Meridian Trail now crosses the River Eden. And there's the continuing path. We now join this overgrown track. Greenwich Meridian Trail now heads up this track. Later we emerge into this field with a fantastic view ahead. Now heading along the right hand edge of this field. We now head along this road. The walk now passes through Broadham Green and Greenwich Meridian Trail takes that road on the right. Green Sand Meridian Trail now passes the Haycutter pub and turns left along that footpath. Now heading along this pleasant path towards Oxted. We've now joined a section of the Green Sand Way Lord distant footpath at this point, and that's the way forward now. Now passing a very pleasant mill stream and pond. We are taking that signposted footpath off to the left there. Now crossing the River Eden again. Still on Greenwich Meridian Trail. We proceed up here. Greenwich Meridian Trail heads up this enclosed footpath. We're now on the outskirts of Oxted and coming towards the end of the walk. You hope. Now passing the War Memorial in Oxted. Now at Oxted Station and the end of today's walk along Greenwich Meridian Trail.